Hey guys, <clears throat> Tyler here coming to you live from the gun room. Uh, so, this is my Surefire G2X Tactical or whatever it's called. 120 lumens, runs on 2CR123 batteries. It's a great light, uh, it goes everywhere with me. Uh, if you've read my blog article about the Tactical Man Purse or carry a flashlight, uh, you know it goes everywhere with me. I'm going to do a video soon, by the way, on the Tactical Man Purse. But anyway, this is, uh, this is my uh, everyday carry light. Now the one thing about it, I like it, the one thing about it is that shooting um, using one of these is not as efficient as it could be just because you sacrifice your grip on your firearm to use a second to use the the light. Uh, it's how I've always done it, but it's uh, it's just not just not doesn't seem like it's the best way. Well, I use PrimaryArms.com for a lot of my firearms related purchases on my other websites that I'll probably mention in later videos. And I'm signed up for their email alerts when they have sales and stuff. They email me and say, "Hey, you know, we know you shouldn't spend money." We know, but go ahead and get your credit card out, son, because all this awesome stuff is on sale right now, and it could be yours. Well, you know what was on sale for the 4th? Oh. TLR1S. Streamlight TLR1S, my friends. You talk about pumped. I was excited. I was excited. So I went back and forth with myself for a couple days, like, well, not really a couple days, a couple hours, because I ordered it on the 4th. But I'm sitting there like, ah, should I do it? Should I not do it? Mine's perfectly functional. I already own it. You know, maybe I should uh, just stick with what I have. You know, I know it works. But in the long run, the desire for new toys got the better of me. And I went ahead and grabbed it. Uh, and so this is the one, <clears throat> one S. So it had uh, 300 lumens. Uh, constant on is a flip down. Uh, momentary on is flip up and double tap up. There we go. Yeah. For a little strobe action. You know, a little strobe action. Uh, I only I got to shoot a few rounds uh, with it mounted the other day. I uh, went out to my little range area. So, you know, the perks of being in the country is that five minutes down the road, I have a little range set up. So I went down to the range and shot just a few rounds just to kind of see. You know, I was doing some other drills, and then I threw it on towards the end just to kind of get a feel for how it was going to affect uh, uh, the balance of the weapon and everything. Now, this is the m and 9 is my carry gun. So there's not a lot of recoil from this gun to start with, you hang a light off the end of it and the recoil is non-existent. It's stupid. But, uh, it does present a problem. Gun, holster, Houston, we have a problem. So I was forced, forced mind you, to place another order. Uh, and it should be here in the next day or two, and I'll have something else to show you. I'm pretty excited. Uh, a TLR1S, my friends. I'm a fan. I'm a big fan already. Uh, not that I'm going to stop carrying my Surefire. It'll just like, it'll go in the Tactical Man Purse, and there it'll be in the Tactical Man Purse. If I need it, I'll have it. Uh, but... I'm pretty pumped about this. Pretty sight. So, and you know, I gotta do more shooting, but uh, when I get the new and improved uh, holster that can uh, house my gun with the light on it, then, uh, then I'll get to do some more drills and stuff, but yeah. I do a lot of, a lot, when I shoot my pistol, 
I do a lot. Of, well, I do everything from the holster because uh, every draw stroke you get, you know, that ingraining that in your muscle memory just over and over and over again, and uh, it makes ammo last longer. If you go, okay, well, I'm going to do a Mozambique, you know, double tap center mass, one to the head, and you draw, fire two, and then we one, and then instead of just doing it again, reholster, draw and do it again. So there you go. Uh, yeah, I'm pumped. I'm pumped. I'll catch you guys later.